welcome back to another van video and we're actually kind of outside again today because it's a really really nice day we've just been to wix and bought that and some other bits but look it's sunny <laughs> Isaac's just cutting off the plastic trim to go on the cupboard doors. I'm just about to pin and stick tile to this, which is very exciting. So yeah, let's do that. I'm scared. It's always really scary putting on the first one. <laughs> Get your hopes up They try to kick me but I won't budge Ta-da! It's going to look a lot better when Isaac puts this cupboard back on I've still got some left over and I'm going to do that all down there But I don't want to do that now because it's freezing cold and we just found out that our heater's been leaking carbon monoxide. We can't really turn that back on. When we went to Wix earlier, we also got this insulation because we need to insulate our batteries because they're going to be a little bit chilly because it's it's been like three degrees or like less than zero degrees at night. So everything's freezing. So we need to insulate our batteries. In fact, now I'm thinking about it, I feel like we should probably do some of that tonight because otherwise they're going to freeze. So I just want to say a huge thank you to our sponsor of today's video, Skillshare. If you didn't know or hadn't heard, Skillshare is a huge online learning platform where you'll find a large variety of online tutorial videos on skills such as photography, videography, graphic design and illustration and many many other topics. The online tutorials on Skillshare are made by individual creators who are people just like you and me who want to share their skills. Normal annual subscription with Skillshare is less than $10 a month which is under £8 a month in if you're in the UK like me and this will allow you to explore an unlimited range of online classes. I will have a link at the top of my description box where the first 1,000 people to click will get a free trial of premium membership so why not go and check that out? and maybe you could learn a new skill. Let me know what you learn and thank you again to Skillshare for sponsoring today's video. Let's get back to Lucy from November. Hello, so as you can probably hear, we have our engine running. It's also bonfire night, hence the uh, well, it's explosion. Not. Actually, yeah, it's not at all. It's just people are still setting on fireworks. But anyway, we have just installed our split charge relay. Wait, what is it? Voltage sensitive split charge relay essentially we have a cable going from the van battery there all the way back along here along there to that which is our voltage sensitive relay to our leisure batteries and it's charged our batteries up to 14 volts it literally took two seconds and our batteries are full which is that's pretty nice, isn't it? That's, we literally... We're saying it's perfect, because if we just want to like do something that's energy intensive really quickly... Like, like have a shower... Turn the heater on quickly, because it uses loads of amps to, to start up and stuff. Yeah. We just whack the engine off You can off just turn on the engine. Um, and especially if it's night time and you don't have any solar, because... Yeah, I meant, I meant at night time. Like yeah. During the day we get plenty of solar, but... It's pretty cool, isn't it? more than pretty good. Yeah, and I don't know if I'm showing the cabinet. Oh yeah, and Isaac's just put the trim on the cabinets so they look a lot better. Sexy. We've also decided that we're gonna have a small shower wall. Up to there. Either up to yeah, there up. or lower. But I think up to there. I think up to there. That is where That's our van, van battery, battery is. Yeah. So we do not want water going Anyone over there. <laughs> no. And so, we'll have a curtain as well. Yeah, to stop water fine. going up into our headliner. I don't know if I've shown our curtain either, but it's a blackout curtain. It's awesome. Um, and it works really well. 
I got that second hand. But yeah, we will see you next time we do something in the van. When I fix the uh, heater tomorrow. I tried today. Oh yeah, Almost this is myself. this is the current state of our heater. Um, I don't know if we said, but we had a problem with our heater and our very kind neighbor came and checked and turns out there was carbon monoxide coming into the van, which is yeah. not Small ideal. Hands, but over a long time, it was enough. Look at this. Yeah, can't wait to put this back on. <laughs> it will look so much nicer when, yeah. yeah. But anyway, we will see you soon. Hey guys, so we just, I just wired um, our garage lights and uh, they're, they're a bit bright. <laughs> Are you ready? Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> what? This is just one. We have two of these. Shut up. Actually having a uh, war outside. Um, this is World War II. Um, but anyway, here's my garage light. <laughs> Isn't that ridiculous? Hey guys, exciting news. We have beautiful under the cupboard, under the sink cupboards. Thank you. Th uh, I can't speak. Show them, just show them. <laughs> oh, there's no handle. How do I open it? Beautiful. No. We also have some drawers which Isaac picked up from someone's skip. Yeah. Um, <laughs> very nice actually. There's another unit there that I thought either could be useful for shelves to go in there or just to go in the garage like it was like pigeonholed. Oh cool. But I would need a car. It let's, heavy. let's go and get that yeah. tomorrow. Yeah. So these drawers are going to go under there? Yeah, yeah I mean these are currently far too big to go in there. These are quite shallow. So I'm going to build, put some ply inside and also these backs I have to replace so I have to put a ply back on it as well. Okay. Um, but yeah. at least we have cupboards. Some big bags to put our, this is all our bedding in at the moment. Once we're up and running it'll hold like our, the blankets and stuff for winter. Be good for storage in the uh, back of the van. I've been really bad at filming anything. I'll take you in there and show you a couple of things that I've built. Been raining for like two days solid now and it's actually, I don't know if you can see that, but blue skies outside. So I'm gonna get out there and see if I can get some work done. I just filmed a tour of the van and wasn't filming. I need to get better at that. Um, right, let's see if I can do it super quickly now. Cause I can't be bothered to do it all again. I think we're showing you these cupboards. Uh, I picked up these drawers from someone who was throwing away a load of stuff in a skip. Knocked on the door, I said, are you using those? He said, no. Um, so I've just added a back and sides to them um, and also cut this obviously to size so that fits in there. I've got a top one and a bottom one to do so there'll be another big one down there and then a smaller one. I also picked this up from the skip and I cut it to fit down the side. Nice few shelves there. Got them for absolutely free and they were just going for the landfill so upcycling as much as we can like these cupboards. Uh, they were being thrown out as well so it's nice to make use of a few things. Hello everybody, um, I've been bad at vlogging again. Took all the fronts off there to straighten them all out. In Isaac style I'm not doing any of those things, I'm starting a new project. I'm putting the shower tray in, or specifically I'm doing the drainage. This is the plug and this will sit like in there. A bit of pipe is going to come along here and then drop down through the floor where we have a perfect get app for our grey water tank. So there's a the hole. And now I've somehow got to widen this hole so that my pipe can fit through. very long time since I've been in here doing this. I finished my exams yesterday so it's time to get back into doing everything. I don't really have anything else to say but yeah be prepared for way more wealth content coming at you because yeah I finished exams so it was painful. Thanks for asking but we move. This is Isaac's new toy. It's a little bit terrifying. Is it loud? Fairly. I'm scared. <laughs> oh, God. My camera keeps saying there's an error, so I really hope we haven't lost all of the footage. 
that was on this camera because the camera's been left out in the van in like minus 10 degrees. <laughs> um, I'm sorry, it's like really, I can't tell if it's just the screen that's foggy or if it's actually foggy for you. Cool. But yeah, basically I have finished exams. So I have all the time in the world. Well, not really, but you know, I have lots of time now to be here doing, doing stuff. This is the current situation. It's an absolute mess, but with so much so much still to do. Apparently, got the heater on. It's like 10 degrees in here now. It was zero degrees when I came in this morning. She's not cool. Anyway, what I've been doing, I'm sorry, I can't go, my like hair is weird. Why is it all misty again? This is terrible. I can't be recording in these conditions. Tiling, I hate it. I hate it so much. Like to me, I can see all the problems. Um, Isaac's taken the top cabinets off because he's a perfectionist and he wasn't happy with them so he's redoing them. Um, oh, I was doing a window frame. I've got these bits of PVC that are gonna be the window frame to cover up like this, obviously. And yeah, I put all the tiles down here too. And I've got some left over so I'm gonna try and see if I can go down there, but the plan was to just paint this bit white. Uh, but I do have some random bits of tiles left. So. I might try and chuck them on, but honestly, I'm a bit fed up of peel and stick. <laughs> Ew. Okay, right, anyway. Let's get to it. So, what I have actually... <laughs> what I've actually ended up... Sorry. Isaac's here. Doing the... He's literally... We always end up working in the exact same space, and it's just not okay. <laughs> I'm using this, like... What's it called? Like, grout? Grouting tape. Grouting tape to do so didn't think, maybe. to do the window ledge instead um the window frame even i've like put it along there and i'm gonna put it all around the edge because it'll just be easier than using this pvc stuff i reckon we'll see how it goes but it currently looks like this um ugly basically isaac what's your plan for today i'm building a third drawer isaac's doing the last drawer to go down there Ta da We have a window frame! Let me turn the lights on. So, that looks so much better, doesn't it? These, if you're wondering, these are the little Velcro bits that we use to Velcro our blinds up onto. Um, so, and I use them to cover up the uh, ugly joins in the corners, so. Isaac's done his draw! It's beautiful. Beautiful. It's so deep. It is deep and short. But now we're gonna try and tackle the uh, shower. This back wall obviously needs to be PVC'd, which is what is on here and on there. This is just a blue film. Um, <laughs> so Isaac's just gonna temporarily screw up this wall so that it stays up can so I can do measurements. Yeah. Is it in? No. Well, can you put it in? Yep. Let me just. Doesn't look terrible. Yay! Isaac's just been cutting that out with scissors and I've just spent the past hour drawing the stencil out for it. It's also absolutely freezing. What time is it? Half three? Ten to five. Ten to five now. It's time to sick of let the <laughs> wall onto the wall. <laughs> time lapse. Just kidding, this is gonna be an absolute nightmare, so we'll show you when we're done. Three, two, one. We did it. <laughs> Go on then, speak. No, I wanted you to show the shower. We have a shower wall. We have three shower walls, in fact. Do we are. Isaac, would you like to give a demonstration of the shower? You just crouch under this thing. Yeah, this pole is just holding up the wall currently. It'll come off a bit. With... It'll come off. Yeah. Um, Isaac is currently standing in the massive shower. Plenty of room. Cool, I think it's dinner time. Yep. This will be stuck by tomorrow. If it can come tomorrow, right. even better. Yeah. See you tomorrow, guys. Good night. Good morning. So I have 
the old overhead covers out there I'm gonna sand them and paint them and then we can put them back on um, because apparently they weren't good enough for Isaac's standards so we're redoing them block off the batteries. What I've done is I've cut out some insulation to go around them because uh, the batteries shouldn't technically like get cold too cold or too hot because it will damage them and so I've just I'm just gonna board it off as well which will like keep the insulation with it and also mean that we can put stuff on top of them. been there in a little while actually I mean it's actually not been that long um, but we used to go literally every single week when we we're in the middle of the van build but yeah that's Isaac getting the bins we were at Good Wicks to get a new counter for the new counter because Isaac wanted a bigger one I don't know if Isaac's told you about that um, if not I'll explain it later let's go look how cute Wolf's Christmas decorations are is adorable. He's got a little wreath that Isaac made and then he's got a garland with some fairy lights at the front which turn on at night. <laughs> he's so cute. Time to go to Wicks. No. Oh. What? Time to go to Wicks. <laughs> um, we've actually already been to Wicks but we just did the transition afterwards. Uh, this is current scenes. Time to go to the hardware store. If only we had a van. Yeah, well, I just didn't fancy driving him here. Um, also, the thing, the main reason we came was to get a counter and they <laughs> didn't have one. Yes, yeah, so we're not really sure what we're doing about a counter. No. We're probably just going to have to come back soon and hope they restock. Um, but yeah, we'll catch you at home. Hi. Hello, guys. Welcome back. Can it's already... Paint. No, I forgot. Yeah, we have barely updated you at all today and that is because we've been so busy, but like... I haven't actually achieved anything, really. But it's just like already dark, so it feels really late. I have a runny nose. I this is completely changing, really. The legs massively. Moving. This, basically, we already had this left over. So... The counter. I wanted to reuse it, save on a bit of money, but... It's not big enough. It's not big enough for when the hogs will take up pretty much everything. There's just not enough space to cook. So, so we went to Wix to get a bigger one and they didn't have one, so we're gonna go and try and find one tomorrow, basically, is what Isaac's trying to say. Oh, later today. Oh, even six? later today, yeah. yeah. I, I don't know if Isaac's explained this to you, but we're getting gas hobs and they're going in this countertop here uh, because the electric hobs just weren't good enough. But also, okay, we went and got paint this is one coat, so it's obviously going to look a bit different to this. It will be probably darker. Um, but this is going to be on all of the battens, like around here, on like the inside here. And just like a few yeah. a few accent pieces of like, it's like a grey green. And I just really like it. It's really yeah. cute. Um, and it will, because currently everything is white. <laughs> so yeah. we just got a splash of colour. What else did we get from Wix? It's all here, I'll put it here. Oh, just yeah. loads of little sealant finishing tool for the uh, shower. Shower, some glue, masking tape for when we do the painting. Uh, a few hooks. What were these hooks for? These are good. So I was going to put one like here oh, yeah. tea towel hooks. for a tea towel. Um, 
these are gonna be coat hooks. Are gonna be coat hooks kind of. that go like here maybe. Um, and this is so cute. Should I take it out? Uh, no, because it'll damp it'll get it? ruined. Yeah. So this is gonna go just there. The end of this. So when we open the door, we can hook our keys and bits and bobs there. Maybe a handbag. <laughs> <laughs> so I finally this. got set square, so now I can go around the van and actually change everything and make sure everything is square. It's a bit late for that, but... Okay. Right, we're gonna go to another Wix. Goodbye. Bye. We went to a different Wix and we managed to get the counter, woo! Whoop, whoop. So um, Isaac's gonna put that in tomorrow, or whatever with it tomorrow. Obviously can't do it now because it's, it's a bit too late. <laughs> That is the drill, which oh, drill is hates life. really unhappy because it's been left in the van and it's very cold. But yeah, I think that's it for today, really. We're just running the engine to check the engine's doing okay and got the heater on. Also got the batteries charging with the engine, which is awesome. So as you can see, the batteries are full. Um, And this is the colour that's going to be going on the walls. Actually, it doesn't. It's going to look a lot different. On the walls? Not the walls. So, that is all for this week's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I've missed making these videos so much. Here's a little sneak peek for next week. Oh, oh, oh what's up? We appreciate everyone who stuck around and watched our van videos. Um, but yeah, it's amazing how everything's really starting to come together. It's very impressive when you take a step back and you're like, Well, I was watching realize... videos the other day from when it was just like, when we were doing the installation, I was like, Whoa. Wow. Good work. Thank you for watching and thanks to Skillshare for sponsoring today's video. And um, we will see you very soon with another Van video. Goodbye. Okay, should we try that again? <laughs> no.